The essential understanding for this lesson is, time can be given to the half hour. Previously, students used analog and digital clocks to tell and write time to the hour. In this lesson, students build upon this work to include time to the half hour. In this problem, time is shown on an analog clock, and students are asked to write the numbers to complete each sentence, and then to write the time on the other clock. This problem is key because it requires students to tell time to the half hour. Listen and look for students who correctly identify the placement of the hour hand and the minute hand, but who have difficulty writing time to the half hour on the digital clock. Some of these students may think that because the minute hand points to six, the other clock must show the number of minutes as six minutes. To help these students make sense of time to the half hour, Display an analog clock showing 4 o'clock. Remind these students that there are 60 minutes in an hour. Then demonstrate how the hour hand and the minute hand move to show the passage of half an hour. Half an hour is half of 60 minutes, or 30 minutes. Explain that when the minute hand is on 6, the time is half past the hour, or 30 minutes past the hour. Because the hour hand is halfway between 4 and 5, the time is half past 4, or 30 minutes past 4 o'clock. Listen and look for other students who write 30 minutes past 4 o'clock as 4.30 on the digital clock. These students demonstrate an understanding that time can be given to the half hour. Later, students will build upon this understanding to tell time using 5-minute and 1-minute intervals.